but he wants to have sex with other women or other people. He wants to bring it out of our marriage. Hi, this is Linda, your Back in the Groove Again coach, with another video as part of our Sex in Our 60s series. Now, you know, I've been single for a long time now, and I remember when I first split up many years ago, and I started dating, that a lot of the men that I was meeting on some of these dating sites wanted to try things that I wasn't comfortable with, whether that meant uh, them observing me picking up somebody at a bar, or whether that meant, you know, threesomes. Whatever it was, I, I wasn't comfortable with it, and, and I'm still not. But this comes up, you know, as people uh, remain married for a long time, they want to consider options. They want to consider having sex with other people or, you know, other lifestyle choices. And this isn't a video about whether that's right or wrong. It's really not about that at all. It, it's really about what it is you want for yourself. Um, so if you're a woman and you're listening to this, I, I want you to ask yourself, is this lined up with what you want for yourself? Is this choice of lifestyle something you're open to? And it could be. You know, I think when we are given opportunities to explore ourselves and explore others. It comes through different forms. And when we notice a certain resistance, it's kind of nice to know where that's coming from and why it's there. So if you're noticing some resistance, you can journal about it, you can talk about it, you can think about it. And if eventually that resistance leaves, then perhaps that's, you know, the direction you want to go into. But notice, just notice thoughts, notice the, the emotions that you're feeling as you're reflecting on these options for you. You know, there's a lot of people who have alternative lifestyles. And I find that when you live in a certain community that doesn't ab adopt the same values as you, the same beliefs as you, it's really challenging to go against that norm. Uh, so, you know, that's something to consider as well. Are you, are you living in a place where it's okay to be different? Or are you living in a place where, you know, if you are different, you're going to be outcasted. You know, all of these different things are things to consider. And if you're thinking, well, it's really not for me, be okay with that too. Be okay with that. Now, there's different reasons why you might not be okay with a different lifestyle choice. For me personally, um, I've explored a bit in the past. I was always uh, intoxicated when I did. So it wasn't something that was natural for me at all. Uh, and so I'd rather be choosing when I am in the right mind, mindset. So, I mean, you, you, want, to, you want to choose whatever it is you're comfortable with, with the right mindset. It might be be aligned with your values or not, but make it about what love means to you. And I'm not just talking about love in a relationship. Love what love means to you, for you as a person, and what love means to other people as well. But first, to you, right? You're the one that's important in any of the choices or decisions you have to make. All right, so if you want more information on my services, go to my website at backinthegrooveagain.com. I would love to be your coach. Bye now.